Hello friends, welcome to Crimson Island. I'm so happy that you're here and today I'm here with a very exciting and nerve-wracking video. It is going to be another collaboration with my besties. Um, so mom's crossing. She challenges the tennis. I'm doing this with Ellie Bell's and family as well. And as you can see, I'm standing in like a nine by nine square type of thing and that's basically the challenge build a theme on a nine by nine square a lot of people have done this like you know kato ej katie on calico and many others my theme which is you know one of the reasons why this is so nerve-wracking is apocalyptic zombie land so that's what i have to work with <laughs> i do have a few items already picked out you know like all of them <laughs> Because I didn't want to spend a lot of time trying to figure out what to do. I just, I don't know. I've been thinking about this for a while. And I'm not exactly sure what apocalyptic... Wait, was it? Apocalyptic zombie land looks like in Animal Crossing. So, you know. This is just my best guess. I'm starting with the medieval wall thingies. Because they look, you know. How many times am I gonna say do you know? I feel like I just keep saying that because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> and I feel like I just got stuck. So let me just run around real quick because I don't think I have a ladder. Um, I thought I was gonna be using... Oh wait, okay. An arch type of thing in between these. But I don't know about that anymore. Because I don't even know if I have one. Oh, I'm so excited for this. I saw someone else do it. Who was it? Oh my god, I can't believe I already forgot. It was on Sassy Jellybean's Tour Island stream. Oh my god. Oh, okay. I think I think their name was Elisa, possibly. And they had the caves turned around and just used them like this. I think it was I think the island was based on Nightmare Before Christmas. And I thought I would just copy them because why not and i don't know how um i'm liking this but you know it is what it is how many times really how many times am i gonna say you know <laughs> of course i also have to have the creepy skeletons i mean it's apocalyptic zombie land there they have to be dead bodies <laughs> otherwise where do the zombies come from who even knows i feel like this is as far as my vision went i have no idea what to do now i mean i think Planting trees is a good idea now. I don't really think I have much. Oh, that's so tiny. That is unbelievably tiny. I wanted it stomp, but not. That's also gonna be tiny. Probably the large. Um, I feel like it's also tiny. <laughs> oh, but of course, for this one, I have to eat something to pick it up. So I think I want it closer to the edge of the nine square so that I can put other stuff in front of it or around it. Not take too much space but still cover up the back. Kind of. I don't really know what I'm doing. Is it obvious by now? I did want to try to use this because it looks a bit run down and like a place where you would go to get some shelter. Do you guys see this clipping? I swear that I haven't seen any, I hadn't seen any clipping like that until the 2.0 update and I don't like it. Let's use a smaller tree here just because I have no more ideas, like I said. I mean, a storefront could be nice, but I feel like it looks weird, just empty. Oh, what is that in the back? Let me turn it around. Oh, <laughs> didn't mean to do that. Oh, but I like these. I like those signs. Maybe we can have it right next to this or behind it you know i said it again stop <laughs> i feel like that blocks most of this so not a great idea but maybe we can have it here at the edge like it's i almost said it again and like it's the entrance to whatever this place is why can i turn it around not that around the other around Oh, that is cute. Stop. Okay, I need to stump it so that it doesn't grow and it stays like a baby forever. I think I also want to plant an 
that is too much on the inside oh it's not gonna go there because of the other tree okay um i can try it here but i feel like it's gonna block too much oh wait i kind of like it also the color of those trees i love them i don't know why i wanted the gap here do i even have anything like the arch thing that i was thinking of the first time let me check okay i grabbed some more stuff and i think i want to have some fences blocking up most of the entrance you know like maybe this is a, a dangerous zombie zone or something i don't even know i'm just placing things around okay <laughs> i didn't find an arch that matched whatever those walls are but i did get a ruin arch that of course is not gonna fit there okay that's better i don't i don't really know what the purpose of this is it just looks cool with the overgrown ivy it just gives me more abandoned apocalyptic vibes i also got this can because i feel like people would stock up on food that doesn't go bad during the zombie apocalypse maybe that's what i would try to do and probably fail and die but we're not here to talk about that today <laughs> also oil barrel because it gives me abandoned apocalyptic vibes i don't know why it just does and i have zero idea so i'm just gonna go with it i do have some spooky items from halloween oh i love them but are the pumpkins too much i also have just the decay trees somewhere around here much better i think but i still would like to try to use some spooky items i do have a scarecrow can you pretend that this is a zombie maybe it's used to scare the zombies you know speaking of pretending that things are zombies i tried finding you know those things that it's a dress but it looks like a little ghost or owl or something like that i tried finding something similar to that i couldn't really find anything this was the best that i could do like that's a zombie i don't know how i feel about it <laughs> but again i couldn't really find much Maybe we can have another one back here climbing up the wall or something i also have this cute well i don't know if it's cute but this hat yeah that could be a zombie climbing up the wall i just need to put some flowers there or something to block it but not pansies because pansies are the worst flower <gasps> or maybe the zombie apocalypse would only have pansies because they're the worst flower oh my god i i would i could not handle that I want to play this the pile of leaves, but of course it's not going to go anywhere where I actually want it, so... <gasps> Shut up! It actually went where I wanted it! That was amazing. That's like, I peaked. I peaked. I don't... I can't do anything better than that. I feel like I'm done, but I feel like I shouldn't be done. Does that make sense? Like, is this it? I have some spiky fencing. I'm just putting it in places where you can't even see it. Well, you can, I guess you can kind of see it there protection against zombies or something i like the bats but i don't really like the pumpkin hanging out from it well i guess it's kind of hidden if you go like this i don't know how to take a good picture of this i feel like it's too big for pictures and if i do it like this most of the things that i did are just completely hidden so cool look at the little zombie in the back though that is so cute and yes i decided i'm going to use panties because of what i said earlier Pansies would be the only flower that survived because they are the worst. And it would check out with, you know, the end of the world. Apocalyptic zombies. Makes sense to me. Is this it? Am I done? It's only been 20 minutes. I really feel like I shouldn't be done, but I feel like I am. Does this scream apocalyptic zombie land to you? Maybe it's just because of the zombies that are just hanging there and you know the dead bodies. <laughs> so I guess this is the end of my attempt at this 9x9 nine nine challenge. I kind of like the front area up until you know the oil barrel and the tree. Everything behind it is just questionable and it clearly shows that I didn't know what to do. Also, I'm kind of mad that I can fit everything into just one photo. This is what it would look like if you were in an apocalyptic zombie on Animal Crossing. Isn't this terrifying? Look at that zombie to the side. Look at that zombie climbing up the cliff. Very scary. I would be terrified. This is definitely not cute. It's just horrifying and nightmare inducing. 
but we all agree look at this can i be the zombie is this better <laughs> what is the zombie like dance is this maybe <laughs> okay but i guess that is gonna be it for this video let me know if this actually looks like this zombie apocalypse because i tried i have no idea what else to do let me know what you would do if you had to do this theme thank you so much mom's crossing for the challenge and the wonderful theme that wasn't stressful at all <laughs> like i said at the start this is a challenge or a collaboration thing that i'm doing with my besties so of course i'm going to leave the links to every single one of them in the description please go check them out and subscribe to them because they are so amazing i love absolutely every single one of them and i am so happy that we get to do another challenge previously we did the 4x4 challenge and now we're doing this 9x9 i wonder what's gonna happen next again please let me know what you thought of this build and what you would have done differently and if you enjoyed it please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for possibly more weird stuff like this i don't know also if you had fun watching this you can totally join me for animal crossing stream four times a week because i'm obsessed <laughs> But yes, I'm gonna go now because I've literally just sat here for 10 minutes trying to think of something else to say. And that is very awkward. So I'll just talk to you guys sometime soon. Bye!